Have you ever seen a roundel that rusted so much it fell off and is on the ground? <laughs> Ooh, Lucas, fog lights. I'm surprised those, well, no, they definitely don't work. Hey y'all, welcome back to Doug's Cars. This is a quick video. I was gonna do a short, but I think I have too much content for this to make it under a minute. So I'm making an actual video. This barn find, 69-ish, 2002, is just amazing. And it's right here. Let me turn the camera around and step through these bikes. Look at this. This is an original owner car, believe it or not. From like, I, I, we think it's a 69. It's, uh, it's Shamani, according to that, which is the the, the white color that the, all these were back then, pretty much. Um, yeah, I mean, it's pretty good underneath, but the guy had it covered with newspaper, so that didn't help. It's got a 481 Virginia inspection sticker, so it's a little expired. <laughs> Take a look at the tires on this. I mean, you don't see tread like that anymore at all, anywhere. It is obviously really dusty, really dirty. Um, and, you know, Pretty rusty too. They obviously had to move it in on on these jacks, um, but it is a roundy, and it's not a big bumper car, so that's good. So it's an early. Again, we think it's a '69, but let me look. <laughs> look, I can stick my fingers there. I hope hope my uh, tetanus shots are up to date. So it does have a lot of rust on the sheet metal, which is which is too bad. I mean, the, the guy stored it with newspapers on top to cover it, and they obviously hold moisture. That sucks. So. I will not be driving this car, as you can imagine, but I wanted to just catalog it real quick because, um, yeah, I mean, just look at that patina. You cannot replicate that. Granted, all the patina will fly off if this thing ever runs again. Um, and uh, hey, don't eat these paint chips, kids. They might have lead in them. So I was told I could open the door. Let me do that. Okay, oh, it does open. Mm -hmm. All right, so I've got your speakers in the back of the door. There's the vent window control and and, and that uh, crank for the window. The rear seat's obviously out. You can see the interior's complete. It's got you know all the gauges you would want. Um, obviously the shifter and the the low back seats. So this is definitely an early car. There's no no headrests, and ooh, it definitely has that that smell of an old BMW that uh, has been wet. Obviously there's a umbrella back there in case you you need it. But the the headliner's in, in decent shape. I mean, <laughs> so that's one thing, uh, but wow, it's rare to get to see any type of barn find. And this obviously is not, this is not where this car was stored. This is a warehouse for classic cars and antiques, um, but it was brought here. But I mean, look, just look, you can see all the, the, the leftover gunk and everything that's just been sitting there for all the years of this was in storage, I assume since 1981, when it would have already been like a 12 or 13 year old car most likely so it was not new and you know cars back then did not I can't really get over here too easily i'll try if i can get the driver's side door open the mirror is missing interesting yeah i don't want to open the door too far obviously so yeah same as we saw on the other side it's just you know steering wheel is really really bad um and see so you can see some of the here's all of the factory uh, stickers, or actually, they might be plates maybe at the time. On oh, this side, there's stickers, but uh, obviously, a US market car. And uh, yeah, old die hard battery. Wow, a little air cleaner there. <laughs> so, just wanted to bring you all this car, it's, it's pretty cool. Um, I don't know what the plans are for it, I doubt it'll be restored, but hey, you never know. Anyway, thanks for watching, and tune in for some more Ducks cars. Quick update this actually is going to be on Bring a Trailer coming up soon, you'll be able to see it there shortly so hey if you want to buy this it's actually clean underneath it's just a little rust on the top so check out bring a trailer soon thanks for watching Doug's cars